My parents were both uh, civil rights activists. They were involved in SNCC, the Student Nonviolent Coordinating Committee, as well as my father was also involved in CORE, the Congress of Racial Equality. And I think that their perspective was important in giving me an education that I think many of my peers didn't have access to. When I was younger, I thought that the things I learned about black history, about the civil rights movement, were information that I would have at home, but I didn't expect to have it in the classroom. And when I got to college and I decided to major in African American and African studies, I realized that this was something that should be an integral part of everyone's curriculum, not just something that they could take advantage of when they got to the collegiate level. And so I knew that that was something that I wanted to make um, a part of my career and that I wanted to bring to students and perhaps impact them the same way that I had been impacted by this information. Well, she's really changed my life. She's been one of the most influential professors I've had here in understanding myself and understanding the society that I live in, all the positive and negative aspects and what I can do to be a positive impact on that. You know, the university promises to change the world and many of our faculty members across all of our campuses do that through research and Dr. Morris is a great example. Uh, she's been conducting research for some time and has published that research in the form of a book which is accessible not only to other scholars but to the general public and to students and it's that connection she has with our students that I think is phenomenal. I love being at OSU Newark. You get the name recognition of Ohio State for the benefits of being at a smaller campus. OSU Newark is also great because you have first class scholars who are engaging in research, whether that be conducting experiments or writing books and publishing books, that these are the types of things you expect at the Columbus campus, but we also have them at Newark as well. And so they're not getting a second rate education, they are getting the best of the best at Newark.